to this week's um, midweek meditation with the minister. I'm Reverend Don Fortune of the Unitarian Universalist Congregation of the South Jersey Shore. And um, October is um, the month we will use, uh, we will engage in, in deep listening and considering what it means to listen deeply. And so I've got a meditation for you today by Joyce Sutphen. S-U-T-P-H-E-N, and we found this on a yearofbeinghere.com, which is a daily mindfulness poetry sort of thing, um, and this was posted to that blog on October 10th, 2014, and so I invite you to listen now to this, Joyce Sutphin, How to Listen. Tilt your head slightly to one side and lift your eyebrows expectantly. Ask questions. Delve into the subject at hand or let things come randomly. Don't expect answers. Forget everything you've ever done. Make no comparisons. Simply listen. Listen with your eyes as if the story you are hearing is happening right now. Listen without blinking as if a move frighten the truth away forever. Don't attempt to copy anything down. Don't bring a camera or a recorder. This is your chance to listen carefully. Your whole life might depend on what you hear. How to Listen by Joyce Sutphin Your whole life might depend on what you hear. Today is September 30th, um, 2020, and it is 250 years since John Murray um, first preached Universalism on the North American continent. And um, that happened not far from here in a place that is now called Murray Grove. Um, and John Murray was um, stuck on a sandbar, well his boat was stuck on a sandbar, and um, he didn't want to be a universalist preacher, but Thomas Potter um, had heard of him and had prepared a, um, a chapel for just the occasion when a universalist minister might show up. And so John Murray listened to Thomas Potter and decided that he would preach just that once at this little chapel and his whole life was changed, as was religion and faith in North America and in the world. And we began, we came to understand universalism as an understanding that all humans, everyone, is worthy of God's grace and salvation. And so I encourage you this week to listen carefully without taking notes. And your whole life might depend on what you hear. Have a great week. Church is at 10 o'clock on Sunday mornings. The link is on our website. I hope you join us. Mm -hmm.